this playthrough of Minecraft is a protest. This is version 1.7.10. It's loading very badly. Sasha Burrell on uh, Planet Minecraft, or from Planet Minecraft, I heard him do this on Twitter, uh, was complaining that the game is now taking more RAM. That's how long it took me to break to start breaking a sand block. Cute. Yeah. So I guess for people who are game developers who have really beefy computers, this version of the game E will be a lot of fun. I'm not so sure it's gonna be fun for me. The reason I'm protesting is because YouTubing and gaming has become such an industry that they're beginning to shut out uh, small YouTubers intentionally. Sword, bow and arrow, pickaxe, axe. Excellent. Ooh, apples. And I resent it. Even other YouTubers are doing it. They'll talk about, oh, so-and-so gave me my break. Well, maybe some of us would like a break, too. But, oh, you've got 200,000 subscribers, and you just bought a fancy watch or a Lexus, and the rest of us are just kind of out of luck, huh? So, I believe in the Internet as a creative commons. As a place where people can self-publish. That's where I spawned. Ooh, that's interesting. Where people can self-publish. Was that the right hole? Because there's another hole right there. Oh, this is as well as I can navigate. And where everybody has sort of a chance. Not sort of. Everybody has a chance to produce content and change the world. Instead of it being only institutions and wealthy people and the same old, same old, the people who have always been the voice for humanity and haven't really done a very good job of it, let's face it. I'm frozen. I'm frozen. Ooh, there's a cave right here. I just have to get to it. Okay. And I think that the voices of common people are essential to humanity and to actually the survival of the planet. We know things that the people who've always done things apparently either don't know or are ignoring. Are those flowers? Because there are better ways of doing things than the way they're doing them, obviously. Ooh, and cows. Well, uh, as soon as I can get over there, when the game will let me. Ah, uh, come on, let me go. Let me go. Let me go. Let me go. I believe that we have things to offer that they haven't thought of. For instance, the way I discovered how you can hold down your mouse buttons, either right or the left mouse buttons, so that you can spam. Mm. Hello. By telling the computer to do it instead of having your mouse do it. Saves on the mouse batteries. Saves on the mechanical wear and tear on the mouse itself because you're not mechanically holding down a button. Now I learned to do that because I have disabilities and I checked my disability settings and I found out that's the thing that you can do. If I cut down a tree before I look at my inventory, then it shouldn't register the inventory achievement, I think. That's why they're always begging you to go look in your inventory so the rest of the achievements will register. If you don't have your achievements register, then when you're playing ultra hardcore or something, um, the people you're playing against won't know if you've got diamonds or, you know, other achievements like that. They won't know if you've been to the nether. Stuff like that. So, yeah, I'd rather fake them out. So, yeah, this playthrough is kind of a protest about the fact that it's become... An exclusive club where only affluent people can have a voice and get the views. And did you know that eBay is making things even harder on us now? Why did that cow make a noise like it's in distress? I didn't hit anybody. Yeah, I got that extra apple. They're making it harder on people now. If you don't produce three videos a week, 
Their new algorithm will sort of like burp you out and forget you. That's sad. Um, and there's other stuff like independent musicians are being um, basically blackmailed into taking these really lousy contracts or YouTube won't let them produce their music. And so they're getting thrown off of basically uh, YouTube for the mere fact that they don't want to take a crappy contract from YouTube that gives YouTube all kinds of rights to their music and they don't get them. Now they don't make the big record companies do that. Oh no. The big record companies get a fair deal. See what I mean? So it becomes more and more exclusive. The other thing is that I'm protesting this business about having to look like a professional, even though I'm not. Uh, more popular YouTubers than I are teaching kids how to make professional YouTube mm. videos. How to use the equipment, how not to have a black band around their videos, how to reduce noise, all kinds of stuff like mm. that. Most of this takes a lot of hardware and software that people like me can't afford. So what they've done is they've taught their little audience to be little connoisseurs of money. So don't like a video that's not all slick and professional looking because, well, actually we would kind of be in competition with them. Because even though I've only got 300 subscribers, even though I only get between 50 and 100 views for video usually, um, that's 50 or 100 views that might not go to some big famous YouTuber and they want them all. So. I'm concerned about my audio quality and my video quality. Right now I'm concerned about right now I'm concerned about the fact that this game is lagging terribly. I'm concerned about quality. But not to the exclusion of me not being able to produce content. So I'll participate as well as I can, but I'm not going to get all hung up. I'm thinking that I am not worthy to create YouTube videos just because that's the new standard. Oh my gosh, this is good news. Alright, looks like we have to make a thing. Alright, I cut down a tree, right? And I'm lagging like the dickens. Now no notice this thing is only looking at these very few blocks. But boy, it's having a heart attack, isn't it? I wonder if I'm gonna I might need coal. I doubt it, but I might. Um so I'm just producing this the way I think it needs to be produced, which is live in real time kind of deal. So I will also try to comply with YouTube's requirement that I must now, whoops, what am I doing? Uh, that I must now produce three videos a week in order to be included mm -hmm. in the algorithm. Otherwise, YouTube is going to ignore my content. I won't show up in search engines, anything like that. That's garbage. It's just, it's garbage. It's not a way to treat content producers. Do you know why YouTube is a multi-billion dollar company that now has been bought by uh, Google, which is really being not ethical? Because we content producers produced content. We do all the work. And we're treated like we're servants. And if we don't comply with their really unfair restrictions and requirements, then we are ignored to death. So I've been producing content as long as quite a few so-called popular and or famous YouTubers. I have, but I can't afford equipment. And I don't have connections because people are like, ashamed to be associated with me because I'm not fancy, you know? But I don't produce bad content. I just don't have much of a way to produce content. Oh, it's getting dark already. I better make a purpose. And it froze again. And now the game is getting harder and harder for me to play. Every version is harder. I saw through the world. I should have seen through the world. Is it because okay, the blocks? recorder stopped? I don't produce content to be rich and famous and whoa. 
I produce content because this game had made me ill and I wanted to make sure that the game wasn't the boss of me that it didn't pwn me so I taught myself to play this game and I wanted to teach my friends who didn't have it yet how to play this game I can earn a living with Minecraft by running a server at some point I don't know when it's obviously not going to happen soon uh, I can also sell handmade arts and crafts oh is it raining I think it is um, and there's other things I can do I don't have to take monetizing uh, which means that I have to have a cell phone I can't afford and that they know my cell phone number and why does Google need to know my cell phone number yeah. So I can do my life just fine. Thank you very much. But I'm not happy with this version of the game. It's really hard. Okay, I've got to learn to use my keys better. All right, so I didn't open my inventory until I had cut down a tree. So that's probably a good thing, right? I didn't, um, whoops. I'm trying to learn to use, not scroll, and I just scrolled even as I said that. <laughs> Try to learn not to scroll. I can put a torch under there. I have to scroll for the larger numbers because I don't have those uh, number of buttons memorized. I couldn't ever reach them in time. And in the fluster and flurry of me trying, what I would do is um, make really bad mistakes. Nope, it didn't break. Okay, I guess I don't need to do that. About you. Excellent. All right, this looks like it's gonna be our house. Oh, I wish I could find some coal. I wish I could play the game. So this version of the game is a protest against being told that we're not good enough. And that uh, we have to spend money to make money. And that we have to comply with artificial standards that have nothing to do with playing the game of Minecraft or gaming. Or being a human being or any of that stuff. Because all of us are good enough the way we are. We don't owe them to pretend to be somebody we're not. And I miss the old days of self-publishing when people would put up blogs and uh, YouTube videos and so on. Based on their real lives. Because it was important to them to tell the truth about their lives. Not to be slick and not to be professional. And to be entertaining in a fake and phony way. <gasps> There's an ender band out there. I have a sword. Am I feeling brave? I have the armor. I'm too squishy. Darn. I have four armor. I mean four armor. Four iron, but I need more than that. They're going to come in here pretty soon. If I don't torch it. So that's what we're doing in this version. Is I'm going to try to be who I really am. Now, when I stop this recording, I'm going to continue playing and do the basic setting up of stuff and find out where I am, because you don't need to see me doing all this dull stuff. But I just want people to know that I know what the game is, and I don't think it's a fair game, especially not for kids, and that I'm going so far out of the game that I can see my mouse outside the game while I'm doing this. This is really lagging out. I don't even know if this recording went well. Because I don't think it'll record when the frames stop. I don't think it'll record the audio. Putting it up anyway. Because this is real life, people. This is how real people live their lives. And we don't have to be ashamed of it. Just because they tell us we do. We don't have to be ashamed. I'm frozen again. The game is getting harder and harder to play. It's daylight. I'm going to go out and get stuff. I'll see you later. <laughs> Bye.